morning, everybody. Welcome to another video on Lang Ultrasound Basics. Today we will speak about one of the most revolutionary signs of Lang Ultrasound, the B lines. If we consider ultrasound a kind of densitometer of the lung, as we have seen together in the first video, B lines are what we see in presence of a partial deaeration of the lung. When the pulmonary air content decreases and the lung becomes more dense, the acoustic mismatch between the pulmonary tissue and the chest wall also decreases, allowing the ultrasound beam to partially penetrate below the pleural line. Correct. And what we visualize are the B lines, which are hyperechoic vertical lines arising from the pleural line moving synchronously with respiration in case there is sliding of course yes and extending to the bottom or almost to the bottom of the screen and the more B lines we see the more dense is the pulmonary parenchyma below the ultrasound probe yes more B lines less air so B lines are a non-specific sign of partial deaeration of the lung and can be present in many different conditions such as pulmonary edema of any etiology, cardiogenic, ARDS, volume overload for instance, interstitial lung disease and interstitial pneumonia. It is important to know that the simple presence of a few B lines is not enough to characterize the lung from the sonography point of view. A few B lines, especially in the lung bases, can be present in healthy subjects and do not have any specific pathological meaning. Yes, a positive examination for B lines needs the presence of multiple diffuse and bilateral B lines. Well, Luna, what do you mean by multiple B lines? Well, multiple B lines means at least three B lines between two ribs when applying the probe longitudinally, or at least three close B lines along the intercostal space when applying the probe obliquely. And what does diffuse mean in this context, Luna? Diffuse B lines means that multiple B lines should be seen in at least two regions of each hemithorax. Hey, hey, stop there, Luna. But there is another situation. If you see multiple B lines but only concentrated in one or even more areas of just one hemithorax, this is a focal situation and not a diffuse condition. We will see that these focal multiple B lines have a totally different clinical meaning. Yes, there are much more interesting things about B lines and more videos will follow on this topic. Thank you for being with us and bye-bye. Bye-bye.